So this question is what I call a simplify question. And what I mean by that is anytime I see on the GRE that there's some expression or equation that I can simplify, I'm going to just do that quickly to, to change my frame of reference from the way the data was presented into a more simplified way. So these binomials, right, the, the product of these binomials, I can solve by using FOIL. Using FOIL, I have first times first, which is x squared, outer times outer, which is 2xy, so positive 2xy, inner times inner, which would be negative 2xy, and last term times last term here, which is minus 4y squared. These two middle terms cross out, 2xy minus 2xy is 0, leaving me with x squared minus 4y squared, which is a simplified version of the product of those binomials, equals to 4. So now what is quantity A? Well, quantity A is x squared minus 4y squared. We see that same thing here, which tells me that quantity A is actually equal to 4, right? Because that's what we're told. We're told that x squared minus 4y squared is equal to 4. It's just that the question didn't give it to us in that format. It gave us, it gave that information to us in this product of binomials format. And I had to do the simplification to see that these two things are equivalent. So quantity A is really just 4. Quantity B is 8. So obviously then quantity B is greater than quantity A, and therefore this is our answer 